<laughs> well, you're not going to take your snowshoes this time. Next trail will take your snowshoes. This still hill is too steep for you. Okay, here, Papa and Lexi going trapping. We're going. What are we going to catch? Um, a beaver. I hope so, eh? Um, I think there's none beavers. You don't think there's no beavers? No. Oh, I hope we. I hope you're wrong. Sure, ho sure hope we can get one. I think we're going to get one. So, this here's the bit of the house where we're at with my wife down the steep hill so she's not going to snowshoe down this one because if my wife couldn't handle it I don't think she's going to handle this hill so I'm going to be pulling her with the sleigh ought to be fun coming back up if I do have any beavers but anyways that's the hill down there where the beaver pond is down the bottom down there Why are you talking to yourself? it's a ways I'm not talking to myself I'm talking to the camera why are you talking to the camera? Because I'm telling everybody what we're doing. What we're doing? Yeah. Everybody? Yeah. You know who everybody is? No. All the people that watch the videos. The you know the videos that me and you watch on, t on the c computer? Yeah. There's other people that watch them too, so I'm telling them what we're doing. Cool, eh? Okay, Papa's going to turn the camera off now. Why? And we're going to go down the hill. Okay, you, you making her? Yeah. I'll, I'll make it. You'll make it? Okay, you keep making it. Papa will move a little farther down, and I'll wait for you here. You remember, hold on to the branches. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Okay, we don't need to study the trees. Let's just go. Okay. Oh, okay. Ah. Okay, now you're going to wait until Papa gets a little farther down. Okay? Okay. Okay, okay come on down. I'm coming. Papa, take a I am. Let's go. Come on. You're making it. Come on, pumpkin, you're at the bottom of the hill now. Let's go. There we go. Now let's go check them beaver traps. Good job. High five on that one. Right on. Can I hold your hands? You can hold my hands. Yeah. You're doing good. Keep going straight ahead. Yeah, if I got a few couple beavers here, this might be interesting. Keep going, straight ahead, bug. Yeah. You think a beaver chewed that one down? Lots of them, eh? What, you see? That's what happens when you don't watch where you're going. You gonna get back up? Okay, we're the number four set over there. Somehow the beavers got all the bait off there and never even sprung the trap. So right now, we're at the, the snare set. Oh, feels like there's something in here. Whoa, what's that, bug? Hey, is that a beaver? Yeah. Yeah. Holy smokes. Look at that. Hello, beaver. He's wet, though. You don't want to pet him yet. No. See, and this is how you get 90% of your beavers in these snare sets, right around the chest, right behind the front legs. That's a perfect catch. Just a medium beaver, but still, it's a beaver. Another good beaver for the farmers. Another good one? Yeah, they don't like the beavers. No, stay over this way, please. I don't want you going close to the house. There's not very much ice over there. I know you don't weigh very much, but... So what do you think of your first beaver catch? Um, we need another beaver. We need another beaver? Yeah. You're right. We got another trap right over here. So yep. Papa will check that one and see. And how will I watch? 
Well, you just watch from right there because you can't go over here. Because to tell you the truth, Papa doesn't even really want to go over there that bad, but I will. Okay. Yeah, I have to to check it. So you just wait right there. Okay. I'm just going to check this one right here. And we'll see if there's anything in this one. Stay there. <clears throat> okay, this one's not even sprung. So one out of three. Say what? How will we bring that beaver home? How will we bring them home? Papa will drag them, okay? Yeah, but first I got to reset the snares. How will we break them? You'll see. You watch. I will, uh, first Papa's got to reset the snares, okay? So I'm going to go to the pack sack. Can you wait right here? Okay. Yeah. like to eat. Yeah, what do they like to eat? Um, crack jam crackers. Jam and crackers? You think I should put jam and crackers on here for bait for them? Well, what do beavers eat when they're out in the bush? Uh, fruit. Fruit? Like that? This is what they eat right here. This is bait for beavers. They eat the bark. See where he peeled the bark off? Yeah. That's what they like to eat. That was what eat. Yeah. That's what beavers eat all the time. All the time? But they will get... Thirsty. Well, they just go in the water and drink the water then. They can't do that. Why? Because they're thirsty all the time. Because they're thirsty all the time? Yeah. Well, they can't be that thirsty. They live under the water almost, most of the time. But they live in there, not in the water. Well, I know. They live in the house, but then they go out of the house and down under the water. And see all those sticks out of, in there? Yeah. That's where all their food is. They, they cut it down and put it in the pond, and then they go under the ice and, and chew off a piece and bring it back in their house and eat it. That's crazy, eh? That's, that's nice. That's nice? That's a good way to do it? Yeah. Better than eating jam and crackers, eh? The crackers would get all soggy. Soggy is so, Soggy is fine? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't think beavers like it, though. Okay, well, Pop's going to fix this snare set, and then we can get going back to the next pond, okay? Where's Good. the next pond? we got to drive some more to it. Um, uh, 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 I wanted to bring this one. This one, actually. Okay, Lax, look where you're going, though, Bug. Go that way. See the trail? Go that way. Okay, here's my little pack mule trying to pull the beaver. Okay, go, kiddo. Are you getting them? No. You can do it. Two hands. I'm... There you go. He's going. Go quick. Keep walking. He's too heavy for me. You think so? Yeah. You're getting them. Good job. Now go, go, go. You want some help from me? Yeah? Okay. You're doing good, bug. Keep going. I'm right behind you. Right straight, follow the trail. See where our, our trail is in the snow? Not that way, straight ahead, right up there. Yep. Keep going that way. Good job. Nope, nope, nope. The other way. You'll sink if you go the other that way. Yeah, that's a girl.
Perfect. Okay, Alexis Vandermeer, what did you think of your first trapping experience? Um, good. Really good? Um, um, I saw a beaver. Yeah? Did we catch him? Yeah. That's your first beaver you ever caught, eh? That's exciting, isn't it? But he's very beautiful. Yeah, he is. Just like the slimy fishy. Just like a slidey fishy? Like just a slimy fishy. Oh, a land fish? A land, like a jackfish? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, like a jackfish, sorry. Okay, a slimy fishy, is that what you meant to say? No, just like a jackfish. Yeah. Okay. He's now, very big. Yeah. And for those of you down in the States, a jackfish is what they call a northern pike up in Manitoba, so. Alrighty, cool bug, let's go hit some more. Yep. Okay, snowshoe. Really, no, don't step on this. <laughs> Be careful where you put your foot. Atta girl. Perfect. Keep going. Good job. <laughs> You're a snowshoer, aren't you? Okay, stand up. You want to snowshoe all the way? No. No? What do you want to do? Um, you want me to get the sleigh, don't you? Yeah. You're going to be lazy toad, aren't you? Yeah? Okay. That's prickly. That's a spruce tree. It's a little bit prickly, yep. Watch your face, we're going under a big branch. Watch your face, pumpkin. Hi, girl. So, Lexi and me, or Lexi and I, are on our way home. We stopped and checked that second pond, but not one of the traps was even sprung. Now that one there, that's where I caught that first beaver. But maybe next time I'm there, I'll show you guys the... Yeah, you want the camera on you? What do you want to say? Okay, anyways, I'll show you the water in there. You, you get the, the snare about six inches down in the water and it completely disappears from view. That water is so murky. And, uh, you know, so a beaver's got to be within a half a foot of the bait before they can even see it. So, you know, maybe I should go and uh, spend some time and actually look for an entrance there. I know I'm close to one of the runs. That might be a, a better way to take them out of there. They just don't seem to be hitting that bait very well. But anywho, um, yeah, I got a. There's a couple of couple of messages on the YouTube channel there that asking about the fur sale and whatnot. But I'll uh, I'll address that later. There's something about. Um, some about the mink ranters and whatnot else. So, anyways, I'll address it later on at home when I can uh, read the messages. And I don't want to misinterpret what was said and stuff. So, alrighty. Well, we're on our way home now. Um, we could have went to a couple more, but it's it's supper time for the little one, and uh, I don't want to keep her out too late. <laughs> yeah, supper time for you, pumpkin. You know you're the little one, don't you? Yeah, it's supper time already. You don't want to miss supper, do you? Show show them what you got for the show and tell tomorrow. What is that? Um, the a stick that the beavers ate all the bark off of, right? Yeah. You're gonna take that to school tomorrow? Yeah. To nursery school? I want to take both. Yeah. Did you show everybody your trapping mitts? 
No? Show them. Oh, they're nice trapping mitts. Okay, say bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Okay, bye. They didn't say bye? No. <laughs> I know, they, they, they'll say bye later on when they see the video, don't worry. Alright? Bye-bye.